Hello, fellow IT superstars. Welcome to the channel IT Superstar. My name is Alan, and in this video, we are going to continue where we left off in a previous video. So previously, we configured uh, two VLANs. We configured some trunking port, router, and a stick to enable VLANs to talk to each other. And in this video, we are going to configure the right side of this topology. So what needs to be done here is basically add uh, IP address to this interface, this interface, and this interface, and then configure some static routes between uh, these two routers. So if I go to router one first, you click, okay, enable configure terminal or ConfT for short, and we're gonna go to interface fast internet zero slash zero, and we're gonna add IP address here, and IP address that we're going to use is 10.0.0.1 with the subnet mask class C standard subnet mask and very important no shut which basically tells the router that we want to keep uh, this interface up good okay I think that should be enough for the time being let's go to router 2 and on router 2, let's uh, again enable conf t interface uh, faster than zero, same one as in the other one. And here we're going to set IP address to 10.0.0.2, 255, mask and no shot very important so at this point let's try and ping router one from router two so ping 10.0.0.1 and let's see if it works four out of five eighty percent great it works okay so we did this now let's go here and we need to configure some static routes. So let's exit out of interface configuration and we need to configure static routes. So to do this, we will type IP route and we will type the IP address where we wanna go. And if we look at the topology where we wanna go from this router is this IP here, this network here. So 172.16.0.0 slash 16. So we will type IP route 172.16.0.0. So not a specific device IP, but the network I, uh, IP. So 255.255.0 slash 0. So uh, 0, 0, 0, 0.0, sorry, the slash 16 is the subnet mask. And now, Basically, you can read this command that we want to use IP route to get to this network. To get to this network, you need to go and then you put the address here, which is the next hop. So 10.0.2. And so basically, let's... Uh, Look at the look at this uh, look at this line here, and let's look at the topology. So we want to go to this network here from here, and we are telling the router, hey, to go to this network here, you need to send that packet and that traffic to the next hop, which is 10.0.0.2. This to this router here, and then he will know where to send it from there. So this is basically what we are saying uh, with this command. Now let's go to router two and configure terminal. And uh, configure terminal, and we're gonna go and we will do the same thing that we did pretty much on the other router. The only thing, the only difference is uh, we are going to target different networks. So we will go IP route 
and then we will add the networks where we want to go so 192.168.10.0 and the class C subnet mask. Okay. And we will say to go there to this network, you need to send packet or network traffic that is destined for this network. You need to send it to the next hop, which in this case will be 10.0.0.1. And I'm going to use up arrow now and because I just have to change single digit. So not to type the whole thing again. And we will do the same thing for the VLAN 20 for, for this network, okay? And yeah, so let's exit out of this. Good, so with this, let's see um, if we go to PC0 and what's this? Okay, so this is from the between these two pieces, that's fine. Let's go and try and ping the other side. So let's go 172.16.0.10, I believe. Okay. Reply from destiny. Ah, okay. So this is also a good troubleshooting. So I forgot one thing. And what do you think that I forgot here when you look at the topology? I mean, it's pretty clear. It says here um, we get reply from the interface 10.0.0.2. So pretty much it can reach there, but it doesn't go through. So what I'm look when I look at the topology, it's Im immediately obvious that we haven't added IP address to this interface here. So let's go to router two and let's go configure terminal again. Interface fast Ethernet zero slash one, I believe, but let's double check. Yeah, it is. Uh, okay, and let's go IP address 172.16.0.1. Subnet mask will be class B. Okay. Good and very important, no shut, no shut, might spell that correctly. Great, okay, so let's go back to PC, uh, see this turned green now. Sometimes it may take like a few seconds, you know, until for, for everything to work, but uh, let's go back and try and ping again. I'm gonna use up arrow. Hit enter and let's see if the ping goes through. Now, as I said, sometimes it may take a short while before it works, but let's see. Timed out, timed out. Received one. Okay, let's repeat the ping and sure enough, it goes through. Okay, so we can ping from here to 17216 network, but let's go to 1716 network and try to ping this this PC on the left hand side. So let's go here to desktop and let's go ping 192.168.10.0. Uh, I believe. Yeah, sure, sure enough, it works. Okay, so. This is it. Now, this topology has been configured. Uh, I will, as I said, I will put a lot more videos. If you have some suggestion and suggestions and you want me to do a video on a specific topic regarding uh, networking, I will cover entire CCNA curriculum and some uh, CCNP routing and switching, also security topics, Linux, automation, uh, AWS, Python, etc. I don't have uh, too much time to put like uh, videos out daily, but I will try to, to, to do uh, at least two videos per week. And uh, yeah, please subscribe, like, my videos so I can, uh, so more, you know, it will help me uh, get the visibility and uh, reach out to more people. And uh, I hope you enjoyed and see you in the next video. Thank you very much for uh, viewing.